<laughs> what not dream Dimwin, works fuck make. you. <laughs> <laughs> We're live. Uh, <laughs> hey, everybody. Welcome back to Total Games Live. I'm one of your hosts tonight, Jake, and I do know some of the movies that DreamWorks made. I'm literally and, Googling. And uh, I'm, joined, I'm joined by Steven, who thinks that the minions were a force that came out of DreamWorks. So, look, look in, so, my, hey, in my defense, I didn't actually, like, I wasn't, could, like, could super convinced that they were, but in my eyes, in the animation world, for the most part, if you're not Disney, you're, you're DreamWorks. <laughs> It's just such an intense take. Uh, you know, if you're like, not Disney, your it. dream works. I get it. <laughs> Boss baby. Boss baby. Uh, you know what? They may have done Boss Baby. They did. I'm let looking me... at it right now. Okay, let me see. I'm going to type in, yeah, DreamWorks movies. Work. Wow. DreamWorks movies. So, yeah, Boss Baby. Oh, Megamind. You know, I feel like people like that. Mega Ma- Mega not... Mind was was fine, but some people really like Mega Mind, and I don't understand. Flushed away. Yeah, wasn't that movie made out of spite because Ratatouille existed? Maybe. Actually, that's most of DreamWorks, isn't it? Just you know, they have trolls spite. though. Trolls is good. Wallace and Gromit scared me as a child. Anything claymation scared me as a child. Wallace and Gromit. Oh, they made the B movie. They made the yep. B movie. Yep. I'll back that up. I'll okay. I'll back up my statement. <laughs> you know what? You're right, Stephen. But when they hit right, they really hit. You know what I mean? Austin, you shut your mouth. Nothing about this game is negative. It's perfect. Go back to Canada. <laughs> Take your ass back to Canada. Hey, Nathan. What's up, Nathan? Gosh, everybody is such a snob for frame rates. I'm. I get. I I understand the issue. If it, I'm just. I'm just grateful that I'm not cursed with that. So, game game launches in two minutes, but um, if it doesn't affect the game, where like it hinders my ability to play the game, then I don't care. Um, and especially if like, if the, <laughs> if the frames drop in like in the town where it, you're just doing like shopping and walking around and stuff, that's fine. They'll patch it out. It'll be fine. This is, this is my thing. I don't think it really bo- bugs me until we're at like two frames. <laughs> like that's when it's like, okay. When it's like literally cut, cut. Yeah, that's that's, that's what, that's I'm, what like, I'm saying. Ooh. As long as I can smoothly play the game, I'm fine. And I come from a history of before I built my own PC, I, I had to from an unknown, unknown. I had to make it work, right? And that meant playing Guild Wars two on a laptop, trying to do world events. Good freaking luck! You got maybe point three frames per second. Uh, the, they'll they'll probably patch it to where the the frame drops are there. And I mean, for, for people on PC, they've probably already done a sixty FPS mod or something like that. Those PC people are crazy. Yeah, I don't think I don't think it's as big of a deal on PC. But the prob what not the problem, but the thing about PC is like they want one hundred twenty frames. Yeah, it's because like, PC, God, 60? PC gamers are a bunch of freaking snobs. Yeah, you freaking snobs. Yeah, Pick I am one. Controller. I'll call you out. 10, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It's really funny to me how this <sighs> game has been a dream game for me for a decade, and you seem way more hyped than me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is my... I was listening to a podcast today... And they kind of it was it was uh, kind of funny, and they they didn't do like a full review of mm-hmm. this or um, Rise of the Ronin. They kind of have they've like I think collected for, for this one of their people Interior their main age. reviewer. Gosh, gonna call me? I'm 30 now. Dragon Star. Ma- <laughs> did we gotta do we gotta talk about that? You know, their main reviewer had done like 20. Shit, I'm 32. 
No, I'm not. Austin, I'm you say that like it's a bad thing. I love democracy. McDonald's around every corner. Hell yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's enable PlayStation pe- features. You could. There are a lot of bad things to say about America, Austin. And I don't actually hate Canada. It's just the only... You're such an upstanding person, Austin. That's the only thing I can make fun of. It's your only stereotype. <laughs> so, in Dragon's Dogma 1... Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I wanted to... Fin- this, let me just get to the point yeah. that I was trying to make. Uh, they were talking about like, oh yeah, like, you know, I like it and maybe I'll come back to it, but there's just too much to play right now. There's too much to play. Like just next week, the, all these games come out, like literally none of them I cared about. And I kind of just realized, I was like, this is the only game I'm like excited about this year. See, and like, we'll see how it goes. This but... after this month, I don't think there's anything else, but everything's falling this month. I've been playing Unicorn Overlord. i am pl- got this. I've got Rise of Ronin. I've got Outpost Infinity Siege next week, and I forgot about that. How do I do picture in picture? Do we need to be in a party? Yes, we need to be in a party. Why aren't we in a party, Steven? Because you didn't make one. On a guest, lend me your ears. This is a very Long small party. Without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since I, I agree, Mason. I agree with that. It is a strange choice, but I think to, Long, to deduct know. from the game for something like that seems petty. At last, but you are right, it should be a thing. But you know what? Last of Us 2 should have had a good story, and <laughs> it didn't, so... Wow, shots fired on... Yeah, your mic sounds really weird. Well, yeah, because I'm... This, this... A party fucked me over. Okay. It, it, you sound like Charlie Brown's mother. I, I can't understand a word you're saying. It sounds like you are talking through four sets of hands cupped around your mouth. Well, that 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 is a great description of what I was doing. I wonder if I can picture and picture in Discord. Uh, it does, Austin, but I don't see that as a bad thing. Ghost of Tsushima like is one of the best PlayStation games ever. If Rise of the Ronin can even get a fraction of that energy going, then it's going to be a good game. So if this is anything like the first game, we are playing as... Oh, interesting. So I don't think we're... Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. there it is. This is... We're we're watching through the eyes of the Arisen, but I, I don't think it's going to be our actual character. It's probably the previous Arisen. I thought that too, Austin. <laughs> All I know is I, I missed a good bit there because I was trying to get that party... Basically, out, there's but... a party in our honor, or in this character's honor, and they are the Sovereign, is what we're called. Uh, so every cycle, there is a dragon, and then there's the Arisen. The dragon chooses somebody to consume their heart. Oh, shit. Mm-hmm. Hold on. Yeah, as a principal, I kind of find that funny that a dragon terrorizing the land picks a hero to come kill it eventually. And well, everybody's like, oh, we're, yeah, we're going to pay attention to this guy. This guy's going to lead our, our whatever. Well, it's, 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 hold on. Get ready for a lot of old English. Okay, um, so the dragon, if I remember right, in w- it, within the cycle, wants to die. He wants to be felt. Um, it, it's it's kind of the I don't know. There's something to do with the cycle where the dragon seeks a champion to be its slayer. I think. So one of the pre-order bonuses was a key to this prison. <laughs> so I don't know what that means. 
Maybe that means you can uh, commit crimes and get out easier. Uh, yeah, I was like, I'm not sure what that means. In the me, first game, you would get thrown in prison. Oh, that's cool. You can select... Wait, no way. Well, that's good. They, uh, they, uh... Oh, wait, I was gonna say they separate the prison by gender, but they clearly don't. <laughs> I don't know about clearly, but, you know. Um... Wait. Oh, uh, yes, existing character. Sure. Is that who the middle guy is? <laughs> yeah. See if these is fun, Nason. Just get ready to lose all faith in humanity. So or, I pick the middle guy, and then I can... Yeah, it'll, it'll pull up your saved characters. That's what it did for me, anyway. Use exist ring? Yes. Oh, great. There he is. <laughs> My little fucking cat, man. <laughs> Looks so fucking wild. Hail, now hold the talk. That's so funny. <laughs> now that I'm here again, I... Don't like your character? Hate, I hate the cheetah fur pattern that I went with. I don't understand everybody's inclination to be like, Oh, look, I made a cat. I made a I made handsome Squidward. I'm going to have such a great time playing this game. No, you're going to hate yourself about ten minutes into the game. I Move. also forgot forgot what hair I gave my character and I'm just wondering if maybe no hair is going to be better for a cat person. But. Fair enough, Nason. You also are probably going to be wearing a helmet that may cover up your hair. That's also true. I don't know. Oh, no hair is worse. <laughs> for sure. Okay, we're just going to stick with what my, my gut went with originally. So what, um, can I not run? That's stupid. Um, what uh, class did you end up picking? So I have it set to mage right this second, and I'm kind of debating if I want to go archer. I went archer. I, th I think if you know you want to do magic, I would start mage. Okay, I'm just going to stick with mage. Because that'll get you used to how magic works. Oh, it's Rook! So my name is Jake Claw. <laughs> So and you'll, my, my pawn's name is Kitty Claw. <laughs> so all that means, I think, is that it's going to show up when people search. The moniker is what your character is known as online if people have like a safe search on or something. That right. way, that way, Pussy Magnet can't show up. <laughs> well, I got Kitty Claw, so. So Rook is here. He is the first pawn you meet in Dragon's Dogma 1. That's a cool throwback. Yeah, you mentioned Stellar Blade. Stella, is it Stella Blade or Stellar Blade? Stellar Blade. I'm not looking forward to that one, but that's another big one that's like yeah. a big title for this year. It's a couple of big ones, actually. <laughs> that's the one. That's the one. <laughs> that's the one that you can play with one hand. You're going to need to. <laughs> Okay. Got to pick up stones and carry them. You feckless dullards! That's like, I'm a, I'm a pick, I'm a start, I'm a take that with me. That's that's a, that's a that's line a, you'll hear me say again. I, I was playing Immortals of Avium uh, yesterday. I think it was yesterday, and there was a really funny part where uh, the green mage immortal was talking to my character, and he was like, "Oh, you got to work on your trash talk," and um, it lets me pick what words I want to use. And then mm -hmm. he's like, "All right, I'll I'll be I'll be Sandrak, and and I'll talk to you, and then then you uh, then you hit me with that insult or whatever." And the, what I chose was, um, gosh, geriatric um, windbag, I think. And when it got to my, Devin was like, "Okay, now you, now you go." Jack just goes, F -f "Fuck you, you geriatric windbag!" Like. <laughs> <laughs> It, it was just like, good lord, he <laughs> he really missed it. He, he really, 
really went for that. Yo! It's Medusa! Medusa Oblongata! That's cheating. They didn't even have to look at her to get turned to stone. They did what the storybook said. And they got fucked for it. I'm still walking slowly behind a group of folks. Oh, is that, this is Rook. What's up, Rook? Yes, that's the guy. When he's calling me a pawn, does that, he mean that? Like... The pawns are a race. Right. Am I a pawn? I don't know. That's. I was wondering that myself. Okay. Um, so far, I don't like this. I do not know how to manually aim. There we go. Hmm. Uh, Nason, I did see someone say they, that there was a uh, Kratos Kick. A, uh, pawn. Man, they really did the archer dirty. This does not like. I I know what they're do like what they're going for. I do not like it. Shoot. Stop looking at me, you bitch! Okay, cool. But what they're going for is the fact that the archer does not have a melee weapon. They just use a bow. And so they're right. trying to make it more of an active weapon. But it, it, it like in doing that, they make the bow feel less precise. And I'm never a fan of that. Mm. Which is why I might end up going magic archer, because that thing is just a missile lock machine. <laughs> you don't need to be accurate. You don't gotta be accurate. Alright, where am I taking this rock? Back where Rook is. Oh, I walked right past him. She's old, Nason. Don't age shame. Don't age shame, bro. I like how, like, the very first thing we do is fight a Medusa. That's kind Pretty. of... It's it's kind of similar to the first game, because one of the first things you fight is uh, Hydra. Actually, the very first thing you fight is freaking Grigori the Dragon. You get your ass kicked. My name is Grigori. Oh, I, yeah, those titties do be flopping. Those titties do be tiddling. You think those guys that were petrified, they're they're dead, right? No. Petrification is a status effect in this game. Fantastic. It made fighting the cockatrice an absolute bitch. The cockadoodle what now? Cockatrice is a version of a griffin. It's like a it's like a chicken griffin, basically. Oh hey look, a griffin! Shooter! I haven't had a magic staff in years. Wow, that guy on, like, the middle guy? That is the worst shot I've ever seen. Oh. They got more flop than broken leg. Jeez. Anodyne? Is that like healing? Uh, is that a spell that you have access to? Or? Yeah, it's it, it created like a bubble. A green bubble? Yeah. That's healing.
That griffin just flexed on those people. So, Steven, help me out here a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yep. If you if you can. Okay. Um, so whenever I'm as a mage, I hold L1 and I activate a magic it's like a longer spell and it's like I have a circle and then there's a circle on the enemy. I assume I'm trying to match those two, but it doesn't either I haven't done it right yet or so some spells it just are, doesn't seem to matter. In the first game spells could be ground targeted. So the circle uh -huh. is where the spell would land. I'm not Interesting, okay. And there you could toggle between ground targeting. Oh no, the griffin. Damn. So sad. Oh, oh, oh! Somebody riding that thing too. We are. Me and me and Rook. Oh. Dang. And poor thing. Who's this Voldemort bitch talking to me? Uh, it's Voldemort. Hallmark? It's Voldemort. Oh. Did I not tell you this game takes place in the Harry Potter universe? And that Voldemort got a sex change after Deathly Hallows Part 2? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you who he really looks like, though. He lo he reminds me a lot of Satan in... Um... <laughs> Devil May Cry, maybe? No, 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 no. <laughs> um, the Passion. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! I know that's a deep that's a deep cut. Only you will understand. But I don't know. Someone might get it. Hey, what's up, Lulu? This is fucked up. <laughs> Rook's getting eaten alive by the krakens that exist in all water, and he's like, "Don't worry, oh, I'll be fine." <laughs> he's just gone. Yeah, did I? He not is super chill about that. Yeah. Did I not mention that you can't swim or you get eaten by those? So that makes a lot more sense. I saw, I've seen people goofing and throwing uh, people into the water. Oh, yeah. Cla and then watching classic. them get eaten. Classic Dragon Stock book. Yeah. Um, but I didn't realize that was just like an always conditional. There are octopi that will destroy all yeah. in the water. I don't really know what's up with that. The fir first taste of freedom. Hail! Poor Griffin. I know, right? What the fuck can Griffin do to deserve all this shit? Well, Griffin's in in um, Grand, uh, in not Grand Soren in um, whatever this land is called. Um, they they're an, a menace. <laughs> they they kill people a lot. I know that we can by simply. <clears throat> climbing on top of them and then letting them take us wherever they want to go. Yeah. But I do think it would be cool if we could ride Griffins in this game. Mm -hmm. So, you know, you were talking about Archer. You kind of don't really know where your shots are going to go. Yeah. I feel like that's very much how basic magic seems to be. Oh, absolutely. And, and you can... It, it, it seems to lock on to something. Do you shoot like little bolts? And orbs? then just start little bolts, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's how it was in the first game. Let's take up your weapon, sir. The big man, like if you do a, I did a big fire spell that ended up being basically like a flamethrower. That was the circle things, and I was like, I don't really know oh, gosh. what the circle connection is, but. What a shot. I mean, right through the heart. Gosh, this is... This is gonna take some getting used to. Good lord. Yeah, I just saw, I just saw you shoot a bush. <laughs> Better being shot from an arrow than those flopping ball sacks. <laughs> did the... Did the Griffin have big balls? And I didn't no, even no, Nason's Nason's still stuck on them saggy titties. <laughs> oh well, yeah. Oh my God, it's Kalen. 
Hey, Kalen. Huh? What? It's Kalen. <gasps> What's up, Kalen? I thought you meant in the game. I was like, there's a character named Kalen. No, Ka Kalen is in the game. <laughs> Kalen, is that he's, where you've been? <laughs> Kalen's a pawn in the game. He's on my squad, number mm -hmm. one. Um, so, so far, Kalen, I mean, I have no doubt in my mind that the game is going to be fantastic. I am pretty off put by what they did to the bow gameplay. Like I have to hold down R1 to shoot and um, I, well, I can maybe change that in the controls. Actually, let's do that. I, I, I feel bad for Rook cause he's over here. Like, I know if you can get to the rift stone, like I, you could bring me back. I'm like, nah, I'm not sorry. Rook. I've got <laughs> other people to bring. <laughs> <laughs> into the into the mix. Sorry, there's not really room on the squad for whatever you are. It's okay. Rook is used to that. That's literally Rook's <laughs> Rook's existence since the beginning of the game has been that. That's his whole deal. Gosh, I'm I'm kind of salty. That the ranger's gone. Oh, I got a trophy. I got a trophy. I'm going to miss the ranger. I'll be honest. Can we just stop game of the year? It's nothing but inviting toxicity between communities now. Well, really, game of the year, especially J Jeff Keighley's game. Like, it's just, it's a sham. It's a fucking joke. It's, it's all just dick sucking. How have you been, Kalen? Hey, there's Robin. Welcome, You're Robin? My Robin, yeah. Can can we not do this formal greeting until I found some pants? What is this? <laughs> Please. <laughs> hey, honestly. Nice to meet you guys. Y'all got pants. Could any you, any clothes really at all, could I you, would I would could you not Welcome. kneel solo down? You might get a look at my <laughs> my, my, my balls. <laughs> I've got a lot to show down there. I just don't know that you I really... Gonna, I was going to try to do a play on words with Arisen and, and, and a penis, but <laughs> it just wasn't there. <laughs> they call me Arisen, and you, as you can clearly see. <laughs> I put the Riz in Arisen. <laughs> I put the Riz in Arisen. They call me Arisen, but really I have already arose. And <laughs> I don't know, it's not good. It's Boo. Not good. It's Boo. Not good. <laughs> Honestly, my guy doesn't look that bad in whatever this is. Nason, I'm probably going to upset you. Oh, fuck. But dr Fuck. One, Baldur's Gate deserved to win Game of the Year. I'm not one of the people that... that thinks it's the greatest thing ever, but it deserved it. I am. And Spider-Man 2 deserved nothing. And this is coming from a guy who, one of my who favorite... Who loves oh Spider-Man 1. I love Spider-Man 1. Spider-Man 2 was a fucking insult. From, like, every po every angle. <laughs> when we return, it is our duty to use our experiences and the knowledge we have gained but I, can, I, I do appreciate that there's not, um, what do you call it, friendly fire in this game. At least it doesn't seem like it. Yeah. Otherwise, this random guard who's taking me somewhere would absolutely be a piece of toast right now. Uh, that, that there might be. Well, I don't know. Oh, wait. No? Huh. Sure. This guy pointed out, I thought the Arisen was at the Capitol. And that made me think, oh, wait, did, the, did that guy claim the title of Arisen just for the fame? But but he was spoken to as if he was the Arisen. Oh, wait, no, well, no, I don't know. I don't know. I attended the Super Bowl. 
because I... it was a Taylor. We had a Taylor Swift theme thing, That's and it was great. I did not watch the Super Bowl, and the only thing I took away from it was that Travis Kelsey can't sing. There is that, yeah. That was pretty funny. I saw someone caption that Taylor getting uh, the ick at live in 4K. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was a weird. Um, I feel like anyone who came for Travis Kelsey and Taylor Swift really had a weird experience, probably, mm-hmm. because he had that. He yelled at the coach or whatever, and then got put out for the rest of the game. And then, like, obviously, we saw Taylor, but she didn't have a surprise performance or anything at the end. Oh, I, I know, Nason. I know, and and I was about to say before Jake rudely interrupted me with whatever he was saying. Um, well, I'm so <laughs> fucking sorry. Was I wish you guys could see Kitty Claw right now. Was I finally that have I, Kitty Claw. Oh, um, well, here, uh, go to the Riftstone, and um, you'll be able to take Robin with you. Oh, that's a cool effect for the Riftstone. In the first game, it needed a loading screen, but in this, it just kind of wraps around you. I really like oh, that. Oh, shit, she looks so good. Are you going to take Kitty Claw with you? Can you take Kitty Claw with you? For this stream, I will, and then I'm never going to, to use her again. I need you to understand that I'm really Oh, fuck, I made her so goddamn tall. It's crazy. <laughs> She's like a full head, head taller than my guy. So, so Nason, I, I have... Uh, oh, hey, Monty. Uh, I, I respect that you like it. I was I was fixing to say so that I, like, I understand why people like it, but for me, I was I was just pissed at, <laughs> at how much of a disappointment the game was to me. Um, and I, ooh, view unique pawns, view official pawns. Can I take freaking Dante with me? That'd be cool. Dora. Dora, Dora, Dora. It's a masculine Dora. bistron. <laughs> I did not expect that. <laughs> Yo, they got M. Bison. <laughs> There's a thief named Yoshi that's level 99. That's pretty cool. I heard X Men ninety seven was good. I need to watch it. Um, Jake, are you at the Riftstone yet? I am. I just got Kitty Claw, and this this bitch who carried me here is still chatting me up. I wish she'd shut up. Someone carried you there. Whoever the guy is, it's like Justin. Justin. You but, talked to Justin. He's the knight that guided you yeah, over but, this but place. I don't, was why like, are you oh, saying oh. Justin so weird? His name is spelled J-U-S-T-I-N. In. <laughs> <laughs> tell me. Tell me how you pronounce that. Yeah, I disagree entirely with the, the mindset of, like... Oh, am I stuck in a loading screen because I'm trying to search for a friend's pawn? That's cool. I haven't even, unless, um, I don't know how, do I need to like set her up to be? I don't know. Usable? I, I'm not sure. Because I, see if you can find my pawn. Just do search for friend's pawns. I, damn, I wish I would, I should just shift. I wish I had just made the pawn me. Please do that. That way I don't have to use kitty claw. Shogun is on Disney Plus. I heard about it, but no, Shogun is on Max, right? It's it's from well, it's from FXX or FX, one of those, and that's owned by Disney technically. So, hmm. All I know is that um, gosh, what's his name? The guy from I can never remember his name. The guy for uh, from John Wick for. The Japanese actor that's got minor roles in a lot of things, but he's like the best part in everything he's in. So. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Sure thing. Sure thing, Robin. How did you. Okay. General. What? Uh, oh. How do I. I just how did you get to that menu that you were looking at? You go up to the Rift Stone. Once you're in that world? Yeah. There we go. Search for a pawn. Um, that, that would make oh, sense. Oh, what's a pawn, pawn ID? Can I give you her pawn ID? I guess. I should probably recruit some other pawns. 
How do you... Okay, I'm just gonna grab the first. Oh, hold on. I don't know how to send you Kitty. So I need to find her. Um, her name is Kitty. Okay. She's gonna be taller than any other character you see. She's a white cat. Uh, I don't, I don't see that search for, gosh, playing Gundam I mean, Breaker has broken me. I keep hitting circle for X. Now I am currently using her. What's, so what's, I don't what's know. your pawn ID? You, 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 that doesn't matter. What's your, what's your pawn ID? I see, I can see everyone else's pawn ID. I have no idea how to see hers. Uh, so... Uh, search for a pond. Friends pawns. No. Uh, uh, my pawn doesn't know any pawns. Advanced pawn search. Level two to four. Okay, vocation. What vocation? She's a fighter. Okay, she's a fighter. Uh, feminine Beastrin? Feminine Beastrin. Quest knowledge, none. Search by, no. Just unable to find pawn. Okay, so uh, for now, it would appear that we just need to... Uh... I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer please dispense... Just hire some pawns and probably do the first quest. Oh, shit. I, sh I shouldn't be surprised if someone made a shadow heart. Of course they did. Whoa, Brom. Nice. Ugh, she ugly. I took two fighter pawns. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, now what? Now, now what do I do? Hail, I don't need you. I don't need you to tell me anything. I know everything about this game, lady. Now where do I go? Uh, training ground? Oh my god. Mayhaps? Someone made a Riley Reed. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is... Welcome this to Dragon's is, Dogma. It's unhinged. Wow. It's fucking something, alright. Riley, I'm sure she is. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Hail. Okay. You were no help. Hello, Maru Maru. Uh, Welcome. What's back. up, Maru Maru? <laughs> they can't hurt you anymore, Nason. and they're gone. You will at least rest for the evening. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Can someone give me pants? That's all I want. You, winch. <laughs> you got pants. <laughs> uh, buy hither the pants. Come hither, find me aught pants. Come hither, <laughs> and find yonder pants. <laughs> view unique pawns, view official pawns. I would, I, oh, go rest. That's what it is. I think when you rest, you upload your pawn. So since we haven't rested yet, our pawn technically doesn't exist in the rift. Okay, how do I leave the rift? Uh, you go. Kitty, up to pull the me out of here. Uh, you go up to the stone and it. Leave rift. There we go. Okay. All right, so I need to. Kitty, goddamn, I'm so happy. Uh, where do I sleep? Hither thee, shither thee. Where dost thou lie thy head? One got ought for for, thine for, for thine head. <laughs> I love Hail how. Thee. I love where how... can thy go take and. Shitteth and a sleepeth. I being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Can I just take stuff? Oh, sweet. 
Where do I where do I rest, Steven? Uh, you should see the bed symbol on the map. Can you set waypoints? Robin leveled up. Okay, you should be able to find him in the rifts now. And I need to get rid of whatever that sapphire rav god. <laughs> Did you take the weird lady with the weird face? Why the fuck? Because she was the only other fighter I saw. Oh, there's no way. I had already recruited the other one that appeared in the uh -oh. rift. Uh-oh. Okay, hurry up and sleep so I can leave. Talking to this guy, Asher's freaking out, though. I might have to run. Well, sleep before you run. I need a pollen. <laughs> Yes, she does die for... Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Kitty just told me she has no problem going to sleep at this time Is that so? Lachlan. Hi. I expect a cardo. What? Kitty is... Kitty is level two. You seem stout of heart. Move my thanks. Okay. Cool. Okay, I gotta go get Asher. I'll be right back. Okay. This is the very start, Monty. I've fought maybe like two things, and the combat with the bow and arrow is is pretty rough so far. But I'm probably gonna end up going spear hand or magic archer. Main pawn is this one's name. They didn't even try. That one's Stuart, and it's a little cat. I just, I just want armor. Seriously? He's still... Okay. Whatever. Whatever. So, the first game, Monty, came out 12 years ago. And I freaking loved it. It was... The, the combat is amazing uh, in the first one. And I'm sure it'll be good in this one, too. Um, and something uh, of note in this with this game is that it runs on the RE engine. Um, thank you, Cam. That's good advice. <laughs> but this runs on the RE engine, uh, just like uh, Monster Hunter Rise. So the Mystic Spear Hand, a lot of their animations, or at least some of them, are very clearly from the Insect Glaive in Monster Hunter. So that reason alone has me like, gosh, I kind of have to run Mystic Spear Hand because that's, that's my weapon. Fulgurous Lord. Let, let, gear, where's equipment? Yeah, and the Mystic Spear Hand, its whole thing is that it is uh, like a double-bladed spear fighter that can also use magic. So it can, like, telekinetically pick up corpses and throw them at enemies. Okay, but so said so north of here. So... I'm just going to start heading west. I'm just going to start heading west. All right, here we go. Out into the wild. Flynn is passed out on the couch. He is... He is sprawled out. Having a great sleep. It is Kalen, and I did pick it up. I will be trying it at some point. I have high hopes for it. I think it could be good. Everyone keeps saying, it just looks like Ghost of Tsushima. And I'm like, that's a good thing. I love Ghost of Tsushima. 
in my opinion, it is one of the best uh, games of... Well, yeah, you know, screw it. It's one of the best first-party Sony games of all time, I think. But it just really resonated with me. Okay. Yep. Draw, draw the bow. Okay. Going in for some kicks. Pawn commands. Four commands. Yep. Go. Act independently of the Risen. Okay, that's good to know. To me. Yep. Wait. Then help. Okay. Yeah, they definitely changed ranged combat. This is probably the reason the ranger's not in this game. I don't think precision hits really matter anymore. The ranger used a giant longbow and was all about getting weak point hits. I don't know. Yeah, I'm excited to try. You really do, Monty. I... I, I think that Ghost of Tsushima just did so many things well. Like, it took a the Assassin's Creed formula and was probably the best version of that formula that we've had. Um, the art design is beautiful. The writing is deceptively beautiful. It really was. Bow combat was great. It's a glad thing we rested when we did. Oh my gosh, just draw the Oh, duh, I switched. That's why I keep screwing that up. My eyes are up here. <laughs> I enjoyed running the raid cuz I just it was a, it was a fun experience, but I would not do it again. I just don't like raids. Okay, ugly woman. Gee whiz. I was going to do that. Okay, so I need to head west. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. So I, I, I made my pawn Robin, as in Robin from Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem Awakening. Or, uh, to the layman, Robin from Smash Brothers. Okay, this is the road we need to follow. Let's see if I get some high ground. Are those harpies or are those really big birds? Let's see if this gives me fall damage. Yep. Oh my god, that almost killed me. Who is this dumbass tiger looking man trying to tell me he could be a mage fighter for me? No thank you. Uh, I couldn't find you. Or I couldn't find her. You couldn't find Kenny? Mm, nope. Those are definitely harpies. This is, this All right, is justice Nathan. will not stand. Sorry, see you later. Night, Nason. Your guy's name was Robin, right? Robin, yes. You did know you Robin. Know, did, did you figure out how to make a... Oh, fuck, there's a tiger man in here. He got blood on his face. Did you figure out how to make a, uh, or see the ID? Uh, no, I did not. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm going to come back now that I finished this quest. You saved me this time. And, um, I'd best be heading back. Okay. Our results are awaited. What say we make now I'm going to go to the, uh, Riftstone again and see if I can see Kitty Claw. It's not too late. You could always make a different pawn. 
could always uh, go back and and then make make a make a good choice. What are you talking about? No, I made I made the best choice. Don't mm. worry about it. That is a lot of money, Kalen. Hey, old friend. Hey, old friend. It's Phil with two L's. Boy, feel. Speaking of training regimes, I must admit a Tis a goodly deed we've done, it it? I love the old English in this game, it's so funny. Okay, I'm going up to the rift stone. There was a pawn I saw named Main Pawn. Nice. Um, search for a pawn, friends pawns, nothing. I I don't see yours either. We need to figure out how to how to identify our pawns. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. Mattress of import. Okay, Robin, tell me your 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 your, your phone number. You, you talking to him? Is that how you do it? Uh, it didn't work. I see a Jade, and I see an Ellie, and she's a giant woman. Giant woman. It's interesting. I'm not... Oh, I see main pawn, too. There's some kind of bullcrap going on. Okay, I'm going to rest... And see if that helps. Even though I just did this. Alright, do I go with Never mind. Sin? Holy crap, it costs a lot of gold to rest. Definitely not Porter. You know what, Aya? Uh, you seem nice. Okay, we're gonna storage. Do I have anything in here? I've got nothing. What does the kind-hearted inclination mean? Inclination is. Did you not give your character an inclination? No, I I do. I just don't like. I I know that means. Kind-hearted is the one that is more t uh, focused on ally support. Um, that's what I gave Robin, because I'm going to try to make him a support mage. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Elia, we're going to bring you along. Now I just need a thief, and I ought to be set. Interestingly, not a lot of thieves just hanging around. I'm sure. Uh, the thief, I imagine, at least at first, until people start to uncover what it does, is not going to get a lot of uh, playtime for pawns. We have found a material. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Had to be sure. By the way, fall damage is pretty serious in this game. Also, save often because if it's like the first game, there's no auto save. And if you die, uh, you go back to your save. Dang. Yeah. Unable to find pawn. Are you going to co op on last run? And um, I'm not planning on getting it. That, uh, that right away, Austin. I was just telling, we, Steven and I were just K talking. Kalen. Kalen. What did I say? You said Callen. Austin. Austin, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I'm not planning on getting it immediately. So, 
Waystone shards. Perhaps this will seem a bit Man. Oh, there's pawn quests. That's nice. One such arisen dismissed me after only half a day of service. Each to their own. Damn, I'm like literally not finding. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Any thieves, period. I don't. Yeah. Full it, stop. I, I would expect to not get a thief for a few levels. Or at least for a few days. Or like, you're not going to find one till tomorrow, probably. Well, you would think. You would think. Um... There, there's got to be one. <laughs> right? You'd, you'd think so, but there, but there also appears to be some kind of weird limiting on go. on pawns right now. In fact, Here we we, we may only be able to see pre pre uh, rendered pawns. Yeah, I'm 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 pulling a thief from the official. Yeah. I'm still f learning how. Oh, it's to. Hey, oh, yeah, That's gross. Okay. Nope, no, thank you. What? There I summoned. I summoned one of these. I summoned the first thief I found. Not a fan. Uh, as of right now, Kaylin, I don't have anybody to co op with on Rise of Ronin. I'm just gonna. I'm just going to play it. I'm going to look again. I'm going to look again. This lady's very bland. I've got plenty to carry as taste and make haste. Well, go on. You're not Combine two materials to create a new item. When combining, you can either choose the materials individually or select a combination that you have previously tried. You can also prioritize the inventory. Okay, cool. Ugh. Items. Can we report back now? All right, what are the odds that Yoshi is a girl? Let's find out. Wait, isn't Yoshi yeah. like level 99? Anyone want to make any bets? Any guesses? You don't spend your rift crystals. He's it's zero. It is a he, and yeesh. <laughs> <laughs> he more like he he heesh. Yeesh. <laughs> not a good look. Not a good look. Okay, now I'm asking myself: Do we want <laughs> non-binary? Maybe. I mean, you know what? You're gonna see a you lot of that in this game. You weren't far. Uh, Okay, I guess we're going with you, Rosie. Still, I, can I haven't used any Rift Crystals, by the way, yet. Good. You should not use those for a while. I've got wares of every oak. Wares of every oak. All right, ladies, let's roll out. Did you really go with an all-girl squad just for the sake of going all-girl squad? No purchases to be made. Uh, yeah, girl squad. That's, that's Do, dumb. Was there was did I miss something in this village? Is there something important I need there's, to do? There's or two talk quests to? you can get. One to the north and then one to the west. Yeah, west. Also, um food and 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 ought goes uh bad in your inventory, so try to use it before you go. Apparently fucking wait. Where's of every ilk but no pants? <laughs> says Monty. The British accent, uh, I'm sorry, the accent that I attempted there was not because of you. It was because of them. I'm not trying to mock your people. I only mock Austin's people. I, and that's, I'm literally only saying that to see if I can uh, lure him out of hiding because I don't even know if he's here or not. Accurate anyway. <laughs> Thank you, Monty. <laughs> you hear that? A British person said my accent is accurate. Let's go save this guy from some harpies. Over, 
All right, Rosie, I'm going to need you to calm down. No, stop. Come back. <laughs> Rosie's out here like, yo, I'm your fucking thief. I got, I got, I know the, I know the lay of the land. Let's rock. There's a, there's an exclamation point here. What does it mean? Uh, uh, Alessandra complained that I ran everywhere, so I picked her up and threw her into a river, and she's dead. Uh. Okay, this is... This... I, I should have just hired four kitties. She's fucking amazing. What level is she? She just got three. Come on, Ella. Elia? 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 What am I supposed to do? This this is this start that's is one rough. of the, that's that's one of the bigger complaints that I've heard that I've personally been worried oh about God. for myself. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh fuck! What is this? Oh har oh with the harpies, duh. Hey, you gotta help. I know if they're doing they're doing something to me. It's not that it's janky, it's that, like... Now, Sapphire Raven is trying to get me to oh, shit. thief. Fuck him up, kitty. Fuck him up. But it's, kitty it's, just got picked up by one of these birds. It's a combination, Kaylin, of feeling slow, but also, like, not giving proper explanation. Like, it has a quest for me, but, I, like, How goes it? Have you gathered everything on the list yet? Yes, I've had it, and I thought... Wait. Bring it. On your head. You're the worst. You. Are they pants? He gave me powder. He didn't give me pants. Shall we report our <laughs> I was just about to say, shit, I forgot about pants. How do I... Oh, uh, we gotta go all the way down. Look, I, I have I have no doubt in my mind that this game is going to really find its groove. But this is a rough start. What's your, what's your issue? You're just confused? Th there's just not a lot of proper direction. The gameplay... I, I feel like that... I feel like they very intentionally tried to remove direction yeah and and th th that is a thing from the first game but I, I if i didn't know better about this game i would be worried right now is what i'm trying to say i guess yeah where's the provisioner i forgot who the provisioner was are you the provisioner I found an apple. A trying time for merchants of any ilk. Much obliged. Merchants of any ilk. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat skills. Uh, okay, Hagger. I am confident. A a random cheeta freaking Cheetara just came up to me outside of the rift and was like, oh, I prefer to attack enemies with dual daggers. Hire me. <laughs> and she cost 68 rift crystals. And I was like, no. I don't Ooh. Know. I found a golden trove beetle, Steven. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> fucking fucking living high over here. So the first game, just as an example, Kalen, the first game you st you started the game as the arisen before you. And you had a full party of four and you got to play as char a character that was established. So you got to see kind of what the combat was all about. Um, and then after that introduction, then you start playing as, as a nobody character. And even then the pacing was, was faster than this. This, this just, I understand games being like vague at, at, at start, well, just vague in general, but there is a sense of with games 
like it's it's approachability, right? Games need to give you a proper idea of how to start. Um, where is this? With any luck. Oh shit! Who's, I'm having a flashback. Who's the fucking provisioner? Why is the table a point of interest? <laughs> oh shit! I hope I didn't miss something. Oh, you went straight to the main objective, didn't you? I did. Yeah, that's where I'm. Did at. I miss something? Well, I mean, I've done two quests. I mean, I saved Bird Dude. So okay, you've done one of the quests then. Are you the provisioner? Just please let me. Oh, hey, look. Well, yeah, when you come down here, um, this guy's got your. Oh my God! Who is the fucking provisioner? Oh, wait a minute. And there is way too much. Oh my God. There's there's way too much. The, the quest menu and the map should not be separated. But they are. That is just a damn shame. No game should have that. Are you the provisioner? Are you the provisioner? It's you. It's you. You have the ugly face. And see, that guy's not marked. There's no quest marker over him or anything. Even yeah, the they don't have anything like that. Even the first game had some of that. I'm telling you, I think they were being very intentional to not do anything like that. Uh, oh, I know. Do you, I do you know where our pre-order bonuses are? We probably don't have access to them yet. Uh, Rift Crystals are not rare, Monty, but they are used to recruit pawns of a higher level than you and in at least in the first game they were also used as a currency for later on for specific like special items we are none of us alike in vocation our respective abilities are unique as well let us utilize our individual strengths wherever possible My party is already talking about, huh, it's interesting, it's all women, except for you. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> I mean, literally, it didn't take two minutes. The kitty goes, huh, so all women, huh? I was like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's weird. Do I, cl do I, do I climb up this? What other quests did you get? Uh, it was one where um, I had to uh, help a provisioner uh, make um, potions, basically. If a pawn just told me, Kitty, what the fuck happened to you? Turn around, kitties over here are like bleeding out. My pawn said something about a rift stone. Mm -hmm. oh, I wonder if Kitty already got it. It is, uh, it is not a premium currency, Caitlin, or at least it wasn't in the first game. It's something you just earn while playing the game and, um, and working with pawns, I think. It's basically a means of preventing you from uh, from recruiting level 99 pawns as a level 1. Although in the first game, um, if you were friends with somebody, it uh, alleviated the cost to recruit them no matter what level. So you could absolutely bust the game. That's cool. I found cinnamon, Steven. Ooh. We're having cinnamon toast crunch tonight. That's what you go to with with. Like you found cinnamon, you, so you're gonna you, create you cereal. Want? I mean, what do you want to do with it? You know. I mean, there. What's your What's your bright idea to do with cinnamon? It, I mean, it's not so much what my bright idea is. It's just that I don't think you in this fantasy realm have the capability to to come up with cinnamon toast crunch. Just because you have cinnamon. 
That's all I'm saying. My new fear is that I'm going to walk near a cliff and one of these, what did that guy call me earlier? Feckless debutites or whatever is going to F and run off a cliff without no realizing what they're doing. Yeah, I'm I'm almost certainly not gonna be playing Archer long term. This is pretty disappointing. Hey, Ron You have fine Ron. goods, do you? Do you have any uh pants? He does not have pants if it's the same guy I talked to. That's a lady. She also did not have pants. Steven, I hate to tell you this. Did she have she pants? Has, she has pants. The lady at the main camp. The lady at the... I walked right in, talked to the dude that was like, hey, go save my boy from all this shit. Harpy's trying to kill him. Well, I guess I'll get pants later. Can you eat your pawn? Yes, I did earlier, Kalen. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. All right, I got some some decent pants now. How much did they cost? Two hundred gold. That's not bad. No. So this is I mean, I had it, you know. Left by the assault are plain to see. I had more more than enough. Mayhap a walk through the streets would help. All right. Uh. You said you had a you had a second quest from this camp. Yeah, it was from the provisioner. He's the fat guy with the <laughs> ugly face. Jeffrey, you... what? <laughs> <laughs> he didn't say. Hope to see you again. I bet it was Jeffrey. He's fat and has an ugly face, but his he doesn't have the title. Provi oh, okay, here we go. Provisioner's plight. So how do you, does it show you, there's literally nothing. Set pro, okay, maybe I have to hold it, okay, hang on. Ah, oh, fuck it, now it's gone, so how do I, <laughs> quest? As far as I can tell, you pretty much just have to eyeball it. Local, local map, what? Like, you have to be like, oh, there's the, where it is, and then just go. Your mini-map gives you no help at all. Wow. Okay, yeah, this is going to be hard for me. Yeah. I need to go out that gate. There's a difference between not hand-holding and just being frustrated. Straight up, figure, figure it out on your own. Yo! Well, here's what I was talking about earlier. I'm fighting a dragon. Hell yeah, dog. How do I block? As soon as I charged forward, a guy immediately goes, We must withdraw! Because he got hit by fire. <laughs> <laughs> we must withdraw. I'm gonna clamber up this dragon. I'm gonna show him what's what. You show him what's what, dog. Hey, dragon. What? <laughs> this is an arm. Kalen, we're literally an hour into the game. It just released an hour ago. Literally stabbed the dragon in, in the in the heel, and it was just like, what are you doing? 
It's like, hey, yo, what, what's, what you, what you thinking, man? What's your game plan here? You got a business plan? Have you, have you purchased an LLC? What's your overhead? <laughs> what's, what's your overhead? Have you thought about costs of operation? Oh, uh, what's up, Marcus? Oh, I don't need anything. I just want to make sure you freaking got. It came out at 11 p.m. for us, Monty. So basically midnight. Yo. At least his teeth are pearly white still. That's something dragons can't. Can't burn. Oh, here, here he goes. He's going to take the heart. It's a lot more graphic this time. Actually, it's not that much more graphic. It's just a lot. the noises are a lot squishier. Do it ear flap. And that is how you become an Arisen. If a pawn tells me they know where something is... Then follow them. Ha. They're not moving, though. Then it's where you are? I don't know. I did not watch the Dragonheart movies, Kalen. I did. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. All right, let's calm down, ladies. We don't have to talk about how I hired all women every five seconds. Good on them for calling out creeps <laughs> for doing that. Good job, Capcom. <laughs> we don't we don't have to talk about it every time. Eventually, one of, one of them's going to be like, hey, you notice how we're all cats? See some kind of pervert? <laughs> <laughs> only one. Only one. I, will t I guess technically I'm one, but... I I really hope that if there is, like, a skimpy armor in this game, that the pawns that you force to wear it make you feel like shit about it. Because that was a big thing in the first game. You'd see so many pawns <laughs> that were just wearing, like, a metal bra. See, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. All right, look. I understand that you all know where this stuff is supposed to be. None of you are moving. So she's not a pawn? I guess that makes sense. She just kind of acts like one. <laughs> Burn. Well, she just deadpan face, deadpan line delivery. So she's either a pawn or uh, she's the lead in a remedy game. She wants that Arisen D. So, so uh, when I shot you but down... But right now, tis shrinking. <laughs> tis flaccid. Tis aught flaccid, the lady. Tis aught flaccid. You must be the one. The ruler of Vermin, currently convalescing in the capital, became Arisen here in this town. If you claim the same, then word must be... Born. Interesting. I found some eggs, and if I've learned anything with in my time with video games, I would just leave the eggs alone. Oh, did you finally learn to leave the eggs alone? I almost shot them, and then I thought better of it. Yes, please show me the way. So, interesting plot point, which we I mentioned earlier, and you probably have seen by now um we the arisen we sh we share the memories of the arisen and we appear to be the arisen but the leader in the capital claims to be the arisen and he claims to have become the arisen in the village that we're in 
and we had a flashback seeing mm -hmm. how he became a risen. So there's some kind of connection. What the hell is wrong with that character? There's some kind of connection between these. Either that, or he like saw it happen. And he was like, "I'm the lion, Sam. Or I'm that was me." <laughs> <laughs> I assumed it was going to be some sort of like multiverse, like. We're in a risen, but we somehow ended up in the pawn multiverse instead of. Not everything is own. multiverse, Jake. I don't no, know. Kinda, kinda not everything has to be multiverse, Jake. Well, I found a princess, uh, Harzus, but. Well, Matt, she told me all about it. It was a very brave thing. I mean, your debt. Well, Rico's as good as mine. Now, tell me, are you registered with a guild? Perhaps you already know this. But registering with a guild will oh. out. That won't do. Go on to a yeah. only take a moment. I heard people talk about how frustrating I can advise you. this no guidance was. Uh -huh. And I thought, oh, I won't be that bad. I won't be that bad. I'm incredibly lost right now. <sighs> the secret to being a successful as you like. Very well. There is no wrong choice, but I shan't take up any more. Master's teaching. Hmm. How do I... So how do I craft? Uh, you go to your inventory, you select an item, and then you combine it. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. My location, Guild. Are there recipes? Uh, kind of. Keen sight. Fuck, man. Oh. That's kind of cool. Okay. Okay. Archer is showing its hand a little bit. Yeah. Um, there is an ability called Keen Sight that basically is a sniper scope. Nice. So I'm going to pick that up. And then Robin. Oh, yeah. Robin's got a lot of. Really hastens incantation speed. Yeah, that's going to be useful. Don't you think the archery will get better? Uh, Monty, stop it. <laughs> uh, yes, I am currently still free balling at Kalen, but I'm going to change that as soon as I possibly can. So, right now, we should probably prioritize Robin getting more spells. Um, okay, so is the circle on you? Do you understand how magic works now, Jake? Man, I'm going to just tell you, I'm sitting here trying to deliver some fucking horse fun, <laughs> and the game's, not, the game's not letting me. The game's not letting me. So you don't, don't want me to I'm explain how magic works? I'm, I'm, I'll be honest, I'm not going to take it in. I'm not going to absorb it right now. So, so well, I'm going to tell you, because it's really simple. You know how you said and, there are two circles? Yep. I, I assume the circle that was on you was red, right? Because it was a fire spell? Yep, yep. The circle closing in is the casting time, right? And then so, the but circle... I don't have to worry about aligning those. No, no. What the circle That's on the enemy is the target. No, the, right. the, the the circle on the enemy is where it's going to hit. The circle on you when it when the circle completes because it's shrinking. When it gets when it disappears, that means the spell is ready to cast. Does that make sense? Yes. Great. Definitely want to get 11. And then, yeah. All right. Wench, point me to the nearest pantaloons. <laughs> Still looking for those pants. Monty, the magic in Dragon's Dogma is insane. 
because I'm it, so excited. it takes the approach. It's the exact opposite of Immortals of Avium, where Immortals of Avium is all about pew, 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 you know, like a lot of spell slinging. Dragon's Dogma is this spell is going to take me 25 seconds to cast, but if I cast it, you are fucked. <laughs> <laughs> but when I do, oh, oh buddy. Because, like, you, if you're a sorcerer, mages can do quicker spells, but they still take uh, invocation. But when you're a sorcerer, you can do things like literally call down meteors from the sky and just make it rain fire. Like, just really big, crazy spells. I am, at the moment... Oh my gosh, another woman wants the wants the D. <laughs> but um at the moment I'm probably gonna target Magic Archer. I think that's where I'm gonna go right now. And it think of it as the difference between the, the example I use with Brody and Jake. Think of it as the difference between playing a regular third person shooter and playing armored core. Magic Archer is armored core where you don't have to really, your aiming is within a radius. So you just have to get within the range and you can like multi-lock. It's like using a crap load of missiles with armored core. And it fires uh, magic shots. It's, it's pretty cool. Very well, I shall lend you my aid. I hate this cat. Let us work together to I go up to this cat wearing leather this leather daddy cat named 14 in Roman numerals. And he goes, very well, I shall lend you aid. It appears you need it. Oh. So you know what? what you, I, you, you started talking about something and then you cut out. Oh. And I wasn't sure if you I, caught I met, for I met, I met this cat that I want to kill. Oh. He's a thief, and he was like, it appears you need my aid, so I will end it. It appears you need my aid for the right price. And my <laughs> for the <thing>. right price. <laughs> <laughs> Hark. 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 Henceforth. <laughs> Hark, henceforth, you shall be knowing my name. My name is Sir Gregory. You need my help. I'm glad to give it for the price. The price being two pennies, but only the red pennies, not the blue. Man, I'm about to Blue jip. is my, blue is Sir Gregory's least favorite color. I just gypped Robin yeah, super hard. I went to the shop and spent nearly all of my money ki kidding up, and I didn't get Robin a damn thing. <laughs> Scrag a beast. Yeah, I'll sell those. Cranberries. Yeah, I got some pants. Look out. Everybody, I got pants. For some fruit, do come again. Do come again. Wait, why do I have why do I have so much stuff in my inventory? Like, also, your inventory has a uh, a weight amount, so keep an eye on that. The the heavier you are, the uh, more encumbered you are, and the faster you spend your stamina and all that jazz. I have figured that out. Uh, Kalen, the. Uh... The Black Panther Captain America game looks fucking dope. Is that the one where with the racist people? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you lost me on that one. I don't know what you're talking about. Wasn't there a team at EA that was like, we don't hire white people because oh, white people are bad? Yes, 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 yes. That's yes, that yes. game? Uh, actually, I don't know if it's that one because I think... I think there's also a game that is just Black Panther and not like Black Panther and Cap. Oh, that's going to be a great game. <laughs> K 
can't wait for what bigoted wisdom they have for T'Challa <laughs> and that masterpiece. It's going to be a masterpiece, to be sure. Oh, shit, I just did a cool, like, high five to one of my pawns. <clears throat> oh, I ranked up my vocation. Nice. So, are you kind of coming around to the ranger now? Because I was going to... I'm not exactly sure how the uh, warfare works, but I'm my guess, since I haven't been able to find any information, is that you have to fully level up up to three vocations, and then you can be a warfarer and switch between those three vocations. I'm... And I was going to do ranger, mage, spear hand, and uh, sorcerer. What makes you think that you have to level up three different vocations? I, I just... Uh, I can find no information about how to become a warfarer. Gotcha. I like, I have specifically searched it. I was committed to like, if I'm going to get spoiled, I, I'm fine with being spoiled so I can know what I need to be working towards. And yeah. the only information I have received is that you will run into people who can teach you the vocations. Like, okay, that's great. Where is this specific one? And like, no one will tell me. Uh, so, well, well, if you get vocations by talking to people, and that's probably what it's going to be. Then. As you can see, well, I would think so, but I just feel like since it's the one that involves multiple, yeah. I just feel like that one's going to be special. Anyway, it doesn't matter. My point is, I wanted to run those three because it seems that's the other thing. A lot of people seem to think that it's a you, you kind of run three vocations at once and not just that you have everything um and i was going to do archer uh spear hand and sorcerer but if you don't like you're not really feeling the so it it definitely is a slow start but i can see that it will get better but i haven't tried it yet since I got the new abilities. Okay. Oh, that's cool. <clears throat> oh, you found pants. I did. It is about time we I'm proud of you. Oh my god. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh. No, Sir, Sir Gregor does not like. I I literally, I, I did the quest, and I I I didn't even stop moving. But he goes, "Tis about time we press on, Master." Oh my gosh, it's Courtney! I just killed a man. What's up, Courtney? I was just thinking earlier. I wish Courtney you was here. You sacrificed because... him to summon Courtney, and it was absolutely worth it. It was. I'll do it again. I'll sacrifice all the all the pussies. He was a cat. That's the joke. I did not hear a damn thing that man just said. <laughs> Throw a jar of poison. <laughs> this is certainly a jar of poison. <laughs> That's the most poison-ass looking poison I've ever seen. <laughs> no, uh, Monty, it's a mixture of they can't swim, and also there are eldritch horrors underneath all water that is deep enough to swim in in, in here, apparently. You've done as I asked, I see. Many things. <laughs> You're a fine arm. I couldn't have done better myself. Mayhap you've had the sense to inherit the skills I possess. <laughs> oh, what are, what? <laughs> this is my new favorite Stephen voice. <laughs> I'm gonna write for <laughs> Forget forget stereotypical uh New Yorker. I, this is this I is it. I haven't whipped that one out in a while. So am I fighting this dragon or oh yeah I am. Yeah. Nobody is a pescatarian in this game. Wait, which one's pescatarian? Oh fuck me. Is, they only eat fish, is that right? Oh God, I'm burning. Let me at ya. What do you need of me? What you need of me? Very good, very good. 
Hit him in the heels, boys. Hit him in the heels, boys. <laughs> come, come, his ankles exposed. Stri strike him in, in the ankles. Who are you? I'm not Norbert. Norbert. Your name's up for no. I love these accents. So. Brave fool said he was going to look for herbs and went off into the forest. I've seen no sign of him since. I'll go and search for him. So it does show your character. I'm not afraid of monsters. In the. In that fight. You please, sir. I worry for my brother. I worry for my brother. I am because I am very much a cat man. Yeah. I like this archer chick. Yeah, that's one that I thought was a pawn. But now she she does want to bang you. <clears throat> they don't call me the arisen for nothing. Wow, this bitch was just. I just talked to her. She was like, whatever it is, I surely don't want to hear it. <laughs> Whatever it is, I surely do not wish to hear it. <clears throat> Excellent find. I don't think I'd like to eat the Elder Tours, but also I don't like to eat fish unless it's sushi. Some I, I like some fish. But also, go to the Rift Crystal and uh, see if you find Robin there. Uh, henceforth, take heed to the Rift Crystal and see if you can... Procure a robin. <laughs> Hark thee, thine child. Hark thee, there may be art of use in the rift crystal henceforth. <laughs> I tell you what. Henceforth, thy may be known thou. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Okay, I need to figure out what quest I want to do. <clears throat> in the dragon's wake. <laughs> Search for Norbert, who is going to gather herbs in the forest. Fuck. Let's search for Norbert. Let's search for Norbert. This came out of nowhere. For Eddie Murphy's Let's Norbert. Let's <laughs> Let's That's what you're expecting. Yeah. Just a... Hi, so I'm looking for a large beaster and woman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go save Norbert and then talk to the guy that wants to take me to the king. Make haste then. We must leave anon. I need time. Very well. Speak with me one. Very well. Who are you? Oh, is that is this the brother? Come along. Look. This must be the brother. Seems not ever goes right with me. Am I doing good at Monty? Is this my <laughs> conversation? Monty, we need, your, we need your affirmation on this. Y'all making it sound like the voice actors were given the direction to speak with the accent of vowels and discomfort like the Scottish people who were extra Scottish. Are you Are you not hearing these guys? I'm, I am right on the money. So, Stephen, walk me through romances in this, because I understand. It's my understanding that you can accidentally fall in love with like an old man blacksmith. Billy, Billy yeah, Billy the butcher, the blacksmith, just because you shop there a lot and give him gifts or some shit. What's the so, story there? If it's like the first game, you simply just do quests for the love interest you want, and uh, the one that you have the highest affinity for will be chosen. <clears throat> Interesting. Do 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 cock do cockney. <laughs> it's a good spot. Let's stop here a moment. Uh, I camped here with my brother many a time. That's that's pretty close. That's pretty close. Mike Camp. <laughs> oh, what's this? A modest camping kit, okay. 
if the Arisen has a camping kit to, to hand, they can pitch their tent by the remains of a campfire. <clears throat> oh, that's fun. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. Something awesome, Monty. I did not. Gosh, Gundam Breaker has broken me. I keep. So apparently in Japan, or at least in Gundam Breaker, um, circle is is X and X is circle. So yes is no and no is yes. And it has ruined me. We ought to press on, lest ought befall my brother. Lead the way, then. It's a sign to play only Gundam Breaker. I am curious if 4 oh, is going to be Fern. good. Oh, Fern. How about that? That's fun. Oh, no! Yo, there's the sniper scope. <clears throat> okay. Still don't see your pawn. Cool. That's weird. Let my magic you with elemental food. I gave Robin a uh, fire boon, so now he can enchant weapons with fire. That's very useful. Unless I am much mistaken, we have cause to visit a place not far from here. Yeah, later, Monty. The decision of which task to prioritize See you, Monty. This is when I wake up now, got a new shift at work, and I clock in at 5 a.m. Dang. So that's where you've been, Courtney. How do I, how do I, ah, there's the lantern, I see. I understand, Courtney. Did, uh, did I tell you that I lost my job? No, oh, there's Norbit. And that Jake also lost his job. <laughs> yeah, we all lost. Curious effect or me. kind of medicine does this girl need? Did you help the girl with the medicine, Steven? No, I've not done that. Oh my gosh. The Fruit Robo Rant. Excuse so, me, sir. Are you an apothecary? Uh, so basically for me, Courtney, uh, you know, I worked at a church, my home church that I've been part of for 23 years. Um, and um, basically I was late to a thing once because I was taking a nap because I have really bad sleep apnea and I'm tired all the time and my body is slowly dying. Um, so I was five minutes late to something in May and, um, the senior pastors were like, Hey, um, we need to do better about that. And I agreed. I was like, yeah, it, in reality, it, it was my fault. That was, it was, but then I was almost late for something in October. So they decided, okay, you're done. That was all they needed. <laughs> and, uh, they thought that I was late for three different things in one day, and I wasn't for anything. Um, so 
what really happened is that they terminated me on false information, but because they ambushed me with the termination because they spoke to the personnel committee before speaking to me or speaking to my actual boss, the, the music minister, um, they ambushed me and him with my termination, did not give me severance, did not talk to my family or apologize to my family about any of this kind of stuff. Um, and then when I tried to fight it and uh, come to terms that everybody can agree with, uh, they refused to comply because they didn't want the slight to mild embarrassment they'd have of going to the personnel committee and saying, hey, we made a mistake. So they decided to ruin my career instead. That's a big health bar. What did I walk? What did I walk up to? No, let's let's let's, let's, let's fight it. What do we got? I thought you were just stomping a man, and then that's that's yep, Cyclops. I figured it was. Steven, I seem to have already become incredibly over encumbered. Yep. You can give items to your pawns. Just be careful about that. Well, I was just going to say, like, I don't know what... Is this one of those games where you're going to want to keep everything you got? Because... No. It's free, be free, whenever, later, whenever you go to rest, use the storage. Can I store things at, like, my camp? Kind of like... I don't think so. Um, but yeah, so Courtney, um, and it's literally just those two guys. Um, everyone else didn't understand why I was being fired. Um, it literally just, it's just those leaders that are, uh, too afraid of being perceived as someone who can make a mistake. So they decided to ruin my career and take my reputation because at a business meeting with the church, um, they lied about what happened. They, they, because they'd gotten a lot of backlash from people that I worked with and volunteers, they lost like five or six tithing families from this. Um, they, uh, said that th it happened because of performance issues over the past two years is what the, uh, the official story is. And that's not true. They gave me a raise last year or the year before last. So either they're really bad at their jobs and they give raises to people that they're wanting to fire or they lied. I've been very bitter about it and I'm trying to move on, but it's really hard to when I'm literally in the church's backyard. Oof. <laughs> How do I roll? You can do it soon. Who's imbuing your uh, stuff? Robin. I told you I gave him uh, the fire imbue spell. Mages nice. can imbue with any element, uh, as long as they have the corresponding spell. That's pretty cool. Oh, what is that? What the hell is he doing? He looked like he wanted to hug. Okay, that was pretty cool. Well, the devs idea for this game was the players to discover and let unfold in all the game design mechanics. Uh, would I ever go back? Asks Kalen. Um, yeah. I mean, it, it would take a lot and I would go back with the intention of finding something else. But, you know, if they offered me a job and I could pay bills, then yeah, I'd go back. I would demand they apologize to me. And if they didn't, I would tell them to blow it out their ass and I'd never leave, I'd leave and never come back. <laughs> Yeah, the, the 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 entire place is is going to is going to shit. There, there's our our senior pastor is a coward who doesn't have any leadership experience. So we have another guy that makes all the decisions, and he is kind of a moron. And he's the one that he's the reason I am fired. That guy is. Uh, okay. So, I, I see what they're going for now. Oh, gosh! <laughs> I just got bitch slapped by a giant club. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. I see what they're going for now, though. They're trying to make 
archery a cinematic experience, essentially. Uh, it, it, and so, like, they're making it to where everything can be done either in, in auto lock or aimed. What the? F <sighs> he threw his club at me, and I thought he was gonna kill me. And I've only got three people. And they're extremely under leveled. Uh -huh. Come on. That was so cool. Oh my gosh. Alright, he's on the ground. Let's get him. Got him. We lose multiple supportive families over a choice. I think it's safe to say nobody liked that. Yeah, you're absolutely correct. Um, ooh, a wizard's hat. Hey, hey uh, Robin, I got you a hat. <laughs> I found okay. you a hat. Okay, so that is what I needed. That fight that I just did. That, that is what I needed to make this the choices they made to range combat make sense. Because combat... Felt, felt better there. It felt a lot better because... In Dragon's Dogma 1, one of the, uh, there was the Strider and the Ranger. The Strider was basically a combination between what we have now as the Archer and the Thief. Because they used dual daggers, had high stamina, and were meant to clamber up on enemies and, and hit, hit their weak points. Um, and then there was the Ranger, which... Um, oh, well, hold on. I keep doing a roundhouse kick by accident. Um, but um, the ranger was the sniper, essentially. And they were able to deal massive damage to enemies through, like, headshots and stuff like that. Um, and they felt really good against regular, like, goblins and, and smaller enemies. The, the archer, as of right now, does not feel that good against smaller enemies. But I think that's because they're trying to make it less of a sniper type and more of just a long-range engagement kind of character that has to put in the work like everybody else, but just does it from a distance. And I, that, I know that sounds like, Steven, you just described an archer, but <laughs> the, the, I think the difference... Oh, shit! Why am I doing this? I just realized we're still escorting what's his face and his and his brother. Uh yes, you have to track lamp oil, Kalen, if it's like the first game. Uh let's see, equip the wizard hat. Where's the wizard hat? Oh wait, I have the wizard hat, duh. Shit, this boy's running. To Robin. Can he not equip it? Let my magic prompt you an elemental. Or else has had 10 people quit this week alone. Holy shit. Two places well, within walking distance are also hiring $4 more Let's an hour with better benefits. With yeah, that's a bad situation. But, um, yeah, I, I did end up getting, uh, I have two part-time jobs right now. One of them is editing with uh, a, uh, a studio, a uh, sound recording studio that is run by a former youth pastor that I know from high school and college and um, the other one I am doing videography with an animal clinic and I get paid basically 10 to 20 dollars a day <laughs> what am I doing in the game or in life yes you're making it more Legolas and less sniper yeah kinda even though Legolas 
kind of one shot killed everything he shot except for like three things. But yeah, they're making it kind of like Legolas if he was if his arrows were made of nerf darts. Mm-hmm. Where like it's it's more flash, less results. But I imagine that's going to change the deeper you get. Like I don't know. Cuz like I do have the sniper arrow. But it, I guess it feels like there is less reliance on headshots. Um, because headshots felt like they didn't do anything to the goblins. It was just kind of another hit. But in a big boss fight, like with the Cyclops, it's very cinematic. Because, like, I can find a perch and then use Dire Arrow, and the animation for Dire Arrow is different from the other ones. Like, when you use Barrage Shot, rather than just firing, th- like, three rapid arrows, you can see in your left hand you have the other arrows held waiting to be knocked. So there's, like, cool visualization to the moves. Absolutely going to play Outward 2, Kalen. Thank you for uh, mentioning that. I am really excited about Outward 2. You know, this really is the year, if Outward 2 comes out this year, this really is the year of sequels to games that Steven told everybody to get and they didn't believe him. Because <laughs> we got Helldivers 2, Dragon's Dogma 2, and um, Outward 2. If Armored Core 6 had come out this year, man, it really it would have been a theme. I'm officially over encumbered. Yeah. How do I give things to... Uh... Go to your inventory, select the items, and hit give. With curatives, um, your team will use them willy-nilly, so don't give them any of your good curatives. My pack's grown rather oh, Courtney, you've missed so much content with Helldivers. Oh, Courtney... It's the best. Oh, yeah, that's where my fourth guy went. I threw him in a river. <laughs> Man, is there like a select all button? Like, just take it all. Jeez. Uh, you can hit left. Like, if it's in multiple quantity, you can hit left, and it'll go from one to the max number. But that's if it's all the same item. So it just occurred to me that I don't know where this guy's brother went. I'm doing the same quest. Where did he go? I, I well, rescued. We, we stopped to make camp, and I didn't want to waste. Okay, camping good. backpack. Yeah. And then he said, "Now he's like, oh come on, we ought not wait because my father, my father might be dead. Might be dead if we wait. Oh, here he goes. Now he's moving. Piss off, ghost." <laughs> Piss off, ghost. This adventure showed me that the path forward managed to save Norwood. Still, I can't help but wonder if I couldn't have. So from now on, well, let's not fall, ladies. Let's let's maybe try to stay up. If anyone knows about being up, it's the Arisen. <laughs> <laughs> ladies, <laughs> trust me, I know a thing or two about being up. Oh, I can use one of my new skills. Woohoo! Oh, didn't mean to do that. So that's rotten. That's probably bad. Um. I... Oh, that was cute. What? I hate I didn't get to participate in that. Ugh, what, what are you making <laughs> your bonds do? <laughs> I was casting a spell, and Kitty came up and, like, held her hand out to high five, and I, I was, like, mid spell, so I couldn't get out of it. Mm. And then um, my archer, El- Elia, uh, she came up and did the high five, and I was like, "Oh, they can do it to each other. That's so cute." The words you keep saying. I know. I know. As soon as I, said... <laughs> I wish I could have taken part in that. Oh, they can Dang do it. To... They can do it to each other too. <laughs> Dang, they can do it to each other. <laughs> I, they can do it to each other. They can. 
Oi, tis, tis, tis thine will that they can do, they can do to one another. Henceforth another, they can, can do aught with each other, they can. They can do aught with each other, they can. Oh Isn't my it? God. <laughs> Isn't it? Isn't it? Anna's gonna walk out of the bedroom and be like, stop. <laughs> like, what the, what are you doing? But she, she loves my British accent. She knows. She knows what it is. <laughs> she knows, she knows what's up. She knows. She knows. What's so if happening. anything, she's probably just laying in bed, like with her eyes wide open, just looking at the ceiling, just like, oh my god. <laughs> maybe, maybe soon he'll yeah. fall asleep. Oh shit! Safe oh to yeah, say you fucking need help, Norbert. If you're gonna stop fighting in the middle of goddamn, work. we've also got another five leaving next week. Kitty, god. Help me out. The lead maintenance guy, as in he's one of two guys, our local driver manager. Something. How many? Like, that's 15 people in two weeks. How many people are there? Surely you're going to run out. Do come again. Do come again. I can't stop. I think that went well. You know what? Yeah, I'll wear the homespun cloak and then I'll give Wolbane that one. I need to give Robin some better armor. He looks... Guys, I didn't mean to make Jack Frost from Rise of the Guardians when I made Robin. They... I didn't... You really did. Holy cow. I, I didn't have what I needed. <laughs> the closest hairstyle looks the same. They're both extremely pale. Just don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Got about 200 people at the warehouse, not including drivers, and... <laughs> yeah, for now. Okay, you need to leave. Tis the time of day when city day, day time? I don't care. Go them. away. <laughs> Cancel the gift. Yes. Uh, choose a rating. Either thumbs up, heart, or none. <laughs> Well, it it's so an, it's so anti-negativity that it's like either good job, awesome job, or say nothing. <laughs> if tis discipline your company lacks, Ooh. I can provide. If we share our strengths, yes, thank you, Rosie. You can always open yon chest. I just am a little confused why you worded it the way that you did. <laughs> She said, Hark, may please allow me to open yon, yon chest. Like, what, whose chest are we opening? What Yon's. We... <laughs> Pay attention. Oh, yon. That's my, that's my bad, Rose. That's my bad. Yeah, I was going to kick this, uh... I'm summoning Corazon. Oh, yeah, he... Oh, yeah, he looks uh, like a Corazon. Yeah, mm -hmm. Rosie is who I have. I see the She's my thief. She's been very helpful. <clears throat> this guy has a specialization? What does specialization do? What the fuck? Hey, yo, Corazon, what's your favorite hey, yo, specialization? What's that specialization, specialization do? Well, now I've got what a you, sausage fest. You... I didn't mean to do that. Uh, no, isn't that interesting? Look, I didn't intend to do it. You went out of your way for like four minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Caleb like... said recruit, Riley. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen Riley Reed yet. I don't know if she really oh exists or if God, Jake's got no, some she's, tabs she's, open. She exists. No harm in picking a few. Let's talk to this merchant. According to somebody who spends more time walking on carpet in, 
A C that on concrete and steel toes. The skeleton crew and warehouses fifteen people. Holy crap! Ah, well met. Here for some that's. that's... I'm not trying to jinx myself, but I felt like there would be more trouble when I had to escort these brothers back. Wait, what is? Okay, sure. Robin has no carry weight whatsoever. Wait, well, does he have to wear that robe? I do so enjoy stocking up on supplies. He, you may not have anything else he can equip. I, I just bought something that he can equip, or so the menu said. Oh yeah, he's he's got it equipped. I I don't want that equipped for him. Much better. He doesn't look like Friar Tuck anymore. Here for some fruit, Roberin, are we? To which I replied at near max volume on. Fuck, fucking, busted. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah, I agree with you. That's insane. Do come again. Oh crap, a staff. I need to get him a better staff. That's what I'm that's what I forgot. Winch! It's a man that I keep saying that to, which just makes it even well, funnier to me. I'm all about it. Why'd you say it like that? <laughs> well, I'm all about a man winch. <laughs> man, man winch, more like man winch. <laughs> man winches, am I right? Look, Sir Gregor, I'm going to need you to just fucking clamp it. Henceforth, <laughs> ought clamp it. Hark, thine, Hark clamp, thine clamp itself. Clamp, clamp thine ass and <laughs> shut the fuck up. There's something about committing to as far as thine ass and then you just say shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut thine ass. Or thine shall have it shut for thou. Ought hence. The accents y'all have been pulling have gone from the boondocks of England to the boonies of Appalachia. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate that. It's interesting that Come mages ahead. appear to only be able to equip four spells in this game. They could, yeah. They could equip eight in the first game. Don't tell me that. Mm -hmm. Don't. Tell me because that. they're they, well. If you were a mage or sorcerer, because the way it worked is you had skills for your main weapon and then skills for your secondary weapon. So the strider and the ranger could have daggers, four dagger skills. No wait, three dagger skills. If so it was six. Three dagger skills and three bow skills, I think. And any class that used only one weapon type could double up. A 
I mean, I'm here for it, oh, but it's don't jarring. don't tell me. Don't tell me. What? Make haste, then. We must leave good. We I must bought, leave I know. I, I bought a fucking spell book. Did you realize I, that it's a one-time use grimoire? No. Um, a brief I'm so mad because I spent a lot of money on it. Spent aught money on it. <laughs> I spent all the money on it. Spent all of you some money on it. He did. In fact, in fact I, saw, I saw my heart and soul through a pawn in the river. Sacrificed it to the great. I sold, I sold Riley Reed for it. <laughs> I went back to the rift and pulled out Riley. <laughs> pulled out Riley? Oh. You're on first name basis. <laughs> Good old Riley. Might have just gotten a quest to go to a uh, Elven village, but the early griffin gets the worm, as they say. Are the people of this are the people just cool with me taking stuff from their house or am I supposed to be uh, I've yet to be uh chastised. Yeah. Uh, Riley Reed is a porn star. Courtney, she's also a recruitable pawn in this game, which is really funny because Jake claims to have seen Riley Reed. I have not seen her. Have, we also we also think we've only seen pawns made by Capcom. Think about that. <laughs> Don't let that sink in. Hideaki Itsudo himself was like, "I like her work." <laughs> I like her work. This will get the kids going. This will get them going. <sighs> see, something tells me that if Jake really did see Riley Reed, that's probably not a, a, an official Capcom palm. But Capcom pawn. That's hard to say. Um, he probably somehow got connected to the to the rift, and I can't, uh, but he still can't see Robin. Yeah, but you, you, you can see, you can see, I mean, you're seeing people. But they, they, I think they're, um, like, just templates. Because it gives you enough pawns to where you never have to play online. I mean, there's, th that is definitely true. Hmm. Weird moment to do a front flip, but okay. I need my double jump back. I'm afraid I'm not going to get it. Uh, I think thieves get it. <sighs> of course they do. Maybe maybe it was archers. It's probably thieves because it was technically a dagger augment or dagger core skill. Isn't that a show? Pawn stars? Yes. It'd be really funny if the Pawn Stars guy was also a pawn, then you could have a porn star and a pawn star on your team. Hey. Also pawn stars and there's pawns. An arisen, by all appearance. An arisen. Another pretender, you mean. It is uncertain. This one commands the Lord. What? Impossible. You know as well as I'm well aware of how preposterous the idea is, thank you. However, if the claim is false, we will be rewarded. I heard that entire conversation, God. Don't, don't act like that was. <laughs> don't act like you didn't ask that other. I am very curious to try Magic Archer, but I'm worried I'm not going to like it. I don't know. I I hate um, that blood magic kind of mechanic that I was talking about that sacrifices health for potency. I hate when classes mm -hmm. depend on that. And so when I read that, that was just like, well, I don't think I'm going to play Magic Archer this time. But if it's not like a central thing, if it's only for like an alt or it's an optional thing, then that changes things. 
so I'm just... Oh, crap. Did I skip a cutscene? I didn't mean to. A chest. Dried fruit. What do you think, Corazon? I like to think that Corazon is basically just Pepe Le Pew, but with knives. <laughs> I feel like Corazon is someone Pepe Le, P Le Pew would fall in love with. Yeah, himself. Oh, He's the kind that would sure. that would look in his knife and be like, "Damn, you handsome son of a bitch." And then he'd like mm, kiss the knife, and then he'd s mm. s slice his lip and be like, "Ah, oh, fuck!" <laughs> the third time this week. <laughs> so really, Corazon just has a lot of scars and band aids on his lips. Yo, I just assembled a new riftstone. It's his reflection. He is Narcissus. Is, the, <laughs> is that a typo or is that a new thing? <laughs> I hope it's not a typo. Because I'm going to start saying... He's a Narcissus. Because saying is like someone who's full of himself and also sus. That's, just call him Narcissus. That's fantastic. He's Narcissus. Pawns in the rift. Oh, look. Main pawn. Magic Wench. Magic Wench is the name of a pawn. Oh, amazing. Oh, Tess, nice. Did no one... Like, did anyone look at the nature? Because all of them are kind-hearted. That's what I'm saying. Courtney, you just made a new thing. Congratulations. Nar Narcissus is here to stay. We shall have to rely on our other senses as the darkness robs us of our sight. Oh no. Well. <laughs> what? <laughs> Who'd you kill? I didn't kill anybody yet. <laughs> I, I don't. Oh god, I hope this is okay. What did you do? So, I'm escorting Sir Gregor back to the capital, or maybe I'm being escorted, I'm you're, not really sure. You're being escorted. One of his posse got flung by a goblin or gremlin or whatever, and they are standing on the smallest sliver, sliver of land in the middle of an ocean. <laughs> and I don't know how to help them, you know what I mean? You can't. Have you seen the rock slide yet? Because I'm doing the same thing. No. Okay. Maybe it's because I knew to just go ahead and get a full squad of pawns. Not to mention there's like a whole nother squad with us right this second. But I'm kicking ass. You know what I mean? Uh, did you fight the, uh, Cyclops? No, not yet. I, that... should hold my, I should hold my applause. So you should hold your applause. But the game is being very easy on you right now, with it only sending goblins and wolves. Boop. Come on, that should have killed him. All right, Kitty, don't you start. Uh, also, remember, if you are out at night, L1 plus right on the D-pad um, uses your lantern. You will need it. Yo, what the fuck? Rosie just caught a goddamn fish with her hand. I was looking at her in the water, and I was... 
in the water do you have to get before it gets bad? Mm. Is the story riveting? I mean, it's interesting so far, but really the main thing that I find interesting is based on what I know of the first game and the fact that there are potentially two Arisens is, is an interesting thought that has me very curious to see where we go. The I, dragon was like, oh, what, what if you guys just... And who he, had, he, had a, he had a cheat day. He was like, I've been good. I can have two hearts. Time is an ever-flowing river in this world, and the activities and behaviors of its inhabitants reflect this. People are unlikely to remain in the same place all day long, and may only appear in the morning, at night, or at midday. To pass the time, you can either stay in an inn or make use of one of the special seats found outdoors in set locations. Come nightfall, you will be able to see no further than the ground at your feet, and the onset of darkness summons fearsome monsters not seen by day. Explore the wilderness after sunset at your own peril, and be sure to have a lantern at your pack. Uh, food goes bad. Certain objects and structures that can be destroyed by your attacks will regenerate after a set amount of time has passed. Similarly... Fruits, berries, and other gatherable flora will grow back in our time. That's good to know. I have found about five cliff faces I'd walked right off the edge of. Yeah. I'm in awe. That's a nice move, Kitty. I opened a chest that was in broad, well, I can't say broad daylight because it's nighttime, but it was right there. And Alucard over here says, I'm in awe of your prowess, powers of detection. <laughs> Alucard over here. His name is Alucard. He's a pawn, I think. Oh, okay. Well, you know Alucard, right? Yes. Yes, I do. He's the uh, weather guy on the Today Show. Yeah. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm about to be in a very bad situation. Did you start a grass fire, Stephen? I don't know. There's still grass around, so I don't think I, if I did, it wasn't that bad. There are rare materials yonder. All right, last I checked, I was following you, sir. Run away. I will say the animations with the... I've probably already said this, but, you know, it's getting late, so I'm forgetting things. Um, the animations with the bow in this are very cool. Like, the fact that you run... When you have your weapon... Uh, in hand, you run around with a bow, with with an arrow knocked in the bow, um, ready to be fired. That's cool. That's a cool little detail. I just fell off a cliff. Okay, never mind. I slid. We're fine. We all take a closer look. Who are you? Who are you? Hey, who are you, lady? La Lagertha. Winch. She's a level nine wizard. I don't need her help. I have, I have, I have, Robin. Is there a quest up here? Oh shoot. The fire augment, much like the first game, is a cheat code in the early game. As your mm -hmm. as pawns fight enemy types, they'll learn their weaknesses. So mm -hmm. mages, especially with how much they can harness elements, um, 
like goblins are weak to fire. Uh, as mages fight goblins, they will learn fire is the go-to here. So if they have the fire augment equipped, they'll make frequent use of it. Steven was nationally ranked. I was. What would I, what would I know? That the archery animations are good? There's just something about it. Because, you know, in, in Dragon's Dogma 1, for example... It, it had a little bit of that, but like if you did like a tenfold arrow, which is where you knock ten arrows at once, um, you would reach back to your quiver, grab a handful of arrows, and then pull them back. But in this, it's a lot more practical to where like barrage shot, you pull the arrows, but your left hand has the other one ready to knock. It's, it's just little stuff like that, where the animations are more unique, where I can tell what my character is doing just by the animation. Like, I could describe to you what the ability does before the ability is done, if that makes sense. Did you make it to the capital guy? Uh, no, I got sidetracked by the possibility of a quest. There's just a random white exclamation point, and I don't know what it does. Nice. Oh, Robin's gotten recruited by some... Um, yes, Robin, go to the chest. He said, while traversing other worlds, I came to know of a treasure chest around here. Would you like to see it? Nice. So Robin's getting some playtime. Shut up. <laughs> you think you think he can do it with... What? You think he and the other pawns are doing it? <laughs> no. High-fiving each other. High-fiving each other. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No. I told him he's not allowed to high five anybody but me. That's probably smart. Me and Kitty fist bumped a minute ago. Ooh. That's rotten. Gosh, I need to sell some stuff. Yeah, I just took the approach of selling everything. Eventually, I'll figure out what I need. Greenswearish and um, really, Greenswearish is going to be the most consistent healing you'll get. I think it's just like a basic herb. Yeah, I saw that. So hang on to that. You're well fond of picking things up. That's good. <laughs> Corazon just goes. You're well fond of picking things up, aren't you? As you said that, the stream for me showed it. <laughs> you know what, Corazon? You get all of my rotten <laughs> scrag of beast. <laughs> you know what, Corazon? Just for that, here's some rotten... Got punched by my blind dog to wake up. Aww. So, Steven, not only... Not only... Are there potentially two arisen? Mm -hmm. This is this apparently is so commonplace. They're not going to let me into the capital because people keep making claims. Apparently, is is that what the black guy the black guy said? Philip or whatever what was his name? He, Gregor. Gregor is telling me this right now. Oh, so you've already seen the black guy then? I'm trying to figure out if you're ahead of me or behind. I'm at a gate. I'm at a gate. I'm at a big gate. It's a black knight telling oh. me. Okay, so you're behind. Another pretend, another pretender. You yeah. mean? Yeah, you're behind me. Gregor, I better not be charged for oil. You just made me waste by talking. <laughs> I could stand here and talk in the dark. Uh, because the Arisen uh, attached to the title of Arisen is, um, well, along with expectation to fulfill the, prophe the prophecy, is um, renown. The prophecy. The prophecy. Because the one claiming to be the Arisen right now is, um, he's royalty. And I'm, I'm sure he was probably royalty before that. I don't. I don't know. 
um, but they 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 command power. The the, the true arisen is able to command uh, has authority over pawns, which are the three: their corazón, uh, Robin, and uh, Alucard. Um, they are pawns. They are the soulless human, the humanoid like beings that live to serve the arisen. They're soulless, huh? Correct. Uh, one of the endings in the first game, you can give your your main pawn a soul <gasps> by sacrificing your yourself. You actually become God at one point, um, and the only way to stop being God is to kill yourself with a special item. Interesting. Hey, a Cyclops. Dang, he just chucked that club immediately. Cyclopses are weak to lightning, by the way. No. No, they're weak to lightning. Yeah, Cyclopses are weak to lightning, I believe. Just so you're aware of that. Alucard just got slammed into the ground. Twice. <laughs> so, other than finding new pawns, what is the point of the rift stones? Or is that is that kind of where it? Like I was saying down? earlier, if you would have paid attention to what I was saying, it was really important to okay. me. Okay. Okay. Let's, um, let's calm down. The rift. The rift stones are in place to. Man, Robin's shooting this dude with a flamethrower. What the hell? But they exist to prevent you from um, you uh, equipping or, or recruiting pawns of really high level while you're at low level. But also there are certain items that some are like cosmetic. Um, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You misunderstand. You misunderstand. Oh, What's rift stones. I see. Of the giant rift stones that uh, take if, us to if, the rift. If your pawns world. die, um, you can revive them at rift stones. Also, pro tip for when you fight the Cyclops, obviously eye is its weak point, but if you give enough damage to its arm, it will drop its club and be kind of disoriented. Out of the way, boys. Move out of the way. You've killed me. You've killed us all. <laughs> oh, dang. The loss gauge. Interesting. I don't... I don't know how I feel about that. Especially when there's no freaking dodge. Up, charge up. Yes, the pawns have in-game lore, Courtney. I'm curious to see to see how uh, it goes with the Cyclops for you. I mean, I'm sure you'll do fine, but I'm curious to see like what you think of the fight. Because Cyclops, Cyclops is that's what I used in the first game. I would hunt down Cyclopses to get easy XP, and they're just fun fights because they're just a big clambering enemy that has easy no to spot weak points. Um, I must be about to come up on it. Holy shit! A whole mountain down. Okay, you've still got a little bit to go. Just a little bit. You're getting close. Is everyone right, Sir Gregor? A deer just ran through your fucking body. That's so funny. That happened for you, too. I thought that was just for me. But he was just standing there while deer ran through him. So this game is definitely... Light your lantern, 
incentivizing rest more. I don't know how I feel about in, that. In what way? Uh, your max health goes down as you t take hits. I'm at ma half max health right now. Oh, yes, yeah. Ah, here's the cart now. Do you intend to join us? It's interesting. That wasn't part of the first game. No. But, like I said, when you would rest in the first game, um, that's when you would upload your pawn and basically get their reports back from how, like, what they'd done in other people's games. And also, any changes you made to your pawn would go through once you rested. Interesting. Fewer monsters are to be found on the main road. I just rested again. I'm gonna doze off. That's cool. Oh my god. I chose to doze off and then was awoken by the sound of screaming goblins. Speaking of dozing, I'm yeah. I'm not long for this world. Yeah, I figured once you fought the Cyclops, that'd be it for you. That's, that's, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking, get there, let me do that. I tell you what, we're gonna have a, I, if you're, t I, I can't imagine it, but a walk in the park right now, because we've got eight people highly capable here. And the Cyclops comes at you at half health. The game is holding your hand right now, I assure you. But I've fought a four health Cyclops down one man, and Ooh. one of my people was at a level one. Burnworth isn't far there you here. go. Will you join us the rest of the way? All right. Into the ox cart. So do you switch pawns pretty frequently? I, um, my strategy is typically, um, to keep the pawns I have with me within a five level range. So as you level up, pawns don't level up with you except for yours. They just earn knowledge. So you need to keep up with me and I need to keep up with you for our pawns to stay relevant in each other's games. Oh. So I'm not doing any, I'm not doing a, a Rosie any favor by keeping them. Correct. You're just shooting yourself in the foot. The only thing you're doing for them is giving them more knowledge, like leveling up their ability to approach certain tasks and fight certain enemies. Like I said earlier, uh, like uh, an example is like if you have a, a fighter in a pawn in the first game, if he fights wolves enough, he knows to call out that wolves hunt in packs when you start fighting them, giving you the, the, the reminder that, oh, there's going to be a multitude of them. And also they know how to pin down enemies they'll like climb on them and be like here i've created an opening take take the opportunity so basically the more pawns fight and like different enemy types the better they get at fighting them beyond just a simple level tick they gain actual knowledge okay interesting yeah so you're using my pawn and me using your pawn we are helping each other mm -hmm. But we just need to try to stay in, in pace with each other. I found a soft neck wrap. I beg your forgiveness for my insolence. If the Queen Regent had learned of your existence, I had no choice but to treat you as a what? Could have been worse. Could have been worse. Think then you have truly lost your memory. You and no other are the sovereign. The only of some days past, you confronted the dragon in the village of Mel, whereupon you became arisen. The people rejoiced, for our true liege had finally appeared. And in Vermont, yet, not all celebrated your. Huh. Your arrival would have robbed the oh, what? Of peace of everything. During the time of uh, uh, Cassie Holland, she acted as a queen okay. in her own right, ruling the palace as she saw fit. And 
just after the consul's passing, when twas all but certain that her son would take his father's place. <laughs> You're telling me I can just pick up any person? Yes. <laughs> Come here, Kitty. She didn't like that. The assassination of the Arisen is an impossible feat for mortal hands. Thus, Disa chose to abduct your majesty while you recovered from your wounds. In order to rob you of your memory with a fell curse and sell you following that, she prepared a replacement to serve as the sovereign in your stead. Mm -hmm. you with your majesty return. I have no intention Interesting. So, the solution of the two arisens thing is is very simple, but it's interesting. It's uh, you're you're almost there. So, um, the person at the throne that we saw earlier, um, they are a puppet. Um, the royal family uh, feel when the previous arisen died, who I believe was the the king, mm -hmm. um, they knew another one would would be be named a new arisen. So when we fought and died in that village, they took us away and basically put us in the camp to 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 be a slave, so that our identity would never be found out. And mm. and the queen trying to keep power to her family, just kind of picked some Joe Schmo to say, oh yeah, he's the arisen, and using him as a figurehead that she controls. Fuck, I don't know who Gan what Gandalf thinks doing over here, but he better fucking run. You that? Did you see an Anthony, you get the fuck out, out bro. What the hell? Oh yeah, I'm wet. Alright, I need to find the inn so that I can see what Robin has been up to. Sorry, so I can see what Robin has been up to. We have obtained that which Miss Flora requested. So we go and deliver it to her. Ah, yes, I know just where to find it. Shit, I might have killed my whole party. What'd you do? I did that. The rock wall thing. This journey will be a long one. Rock wall thing. Oh, that's cool. Corazon is like, hey, I know where we need to go to return this quest, and he's trying to get me to leave this town. <laughs> he's like, yeah, come with me. We just have to take like a two days trip via ox cart. No. Alright, I don't, again. I smoked. Smoked. That Cyclops. I figured you would. But I think Kitty is stuck under his butt. There she is. <laughs> she found her way out. I've all manner of arms for sale. Come. Oh, we've all manner of arms to sell. I'm, 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 I'm actually getting tired. <laughs> yeah, I am too. I'm ready to be done at work tomorrow, so I can. Come back to this game. This will be fun. All right, so I'm gonna. I, we're gonna. We gotta fix the um, IDs. Yes. Um, oh dang, that's expensive. I will head to a rift zone now oh, since fine. I'm in the town. That's just as well. No, not that we have to figure it out now. I just meant. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I'm well, actually. It's not a rift zone. Anymore. So Steven. So Steven. Uh -huh. So Steven. If I give, say, an item to well, someone who's not my main pawn, they take it with them. The Interesting. Which means we could uh, give each other stuff via our pawns. But I think they're they, going to take it. 
they're going to take it back. Interesting. I think it, it's if they're equipped. I th- it, there's something about it. Okay, so I need to be kind of careful with who I give what. Correct. Crazy. Also, if it's like the first game, uh, you do want to be picking up everything because right. uh, you upgrade weapons using stuff that you like Cyclops tusks and stuff like that or goblin feces. I don't know. <laughs> um, so pick goblin up all- feces is really, really good for sharpening. It is. Um, so when you go to upgrade that stuff, if it's like the first game, it pulls from your storage. So just throw all that in your storage and, and you'll be able to craft from your storage. God of War stream impressions. So yeah, you keep stream. saying that. Storage. What, what? Ins. Go to an inn and and talk to the menu. It'll say organize storage underneath rest. God of War stream impressions was my first stream with you guys. Was it? And which stream? Because I wouldn't have been a part I of thought, that. I thought it was in... Uh... I think he found us uh, watching. An arcade. He, I think he said he found us watching Far Cry Arcade, but that may have been oh the first God. stream he attended. What? We must rest. <laughs> I found a pawn who's completely naked. Yep. <laughs> Just walking around. Her name's a Red. She, I was about to say, is she hanging dong? Are they hanging dong? <laughs> <laughs> no. Is he him hanging dong? <laughs> No, they they are not hanging dong. Okay. They are a mage, though. That's that's not connected to the question I asked. (laughs) All right, I better get out of here before Asher. Make sure you save your game. Yep, save and continue. All right, I will catch y'all next time. I'm about to head out as well, but... Um, well, I'm checking a couple things before I do. Forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated. Oh, he already. Dang, he he bailed. To the foremost hospitality, eat much obliged. Much obliged. I'm gonna go to the rift crystal. Oh, it's poor crystal. Been wondering about this. And then, yo, that's a big rift crystal if that's the rift crystal. Oh, it's the pawn guild. Of course it is. Hell yeah. Um, let me, uh, there we go. There's Dante. Looks nothing like Dante. Still can't find his pawn. Whatever. Well. I need to go to bed. I've got the clinic tomorrow which won't take long at all but I've still got to work in the morning so okay that was great to hear from you Courtney if you're still here it was great to hear from you as well um, surely one of us is going to be streaming more of this game this weekend so look out for that honestly if see I don't know okay, because it, it sounds like pawns are getting like my pawn is getting used by someone else's game, but it's weird that we can't see each other. So I don't know. I'm sure it'll be fixed tomorrow. But um, it sounds like if Jake and I are both playing this game tomorrow, um, then we may just stream it during the day and do kind of what we did today. But maybe incorporate the picture picture. I don't know. We'll find out. But thanks for tuning in. Kayla, hope to hear from you again soon. Till next time. Bye, guys.